So Fortnite 1 does not exist anymore, right? Huh? Does it run out of batteries? Yes, no. Ooh, stop. Two hundred. All right, we we gotta go to the levers and things. Can't do that. Uh, the bot will do the bot. Three switches. That'll be easy enough. Two, uh, Three switches. <laughs> Whoa! Ow! Uh, we are just about to die. Oh. She got it. Wait to die. Thank you. <laughs> Might heal awesome. a bit. Three armor, three armor, the, oh. and, and this one does also happens to make your melee weapon go up. Uh, which one does? This one. Oh, cool. So we can just look like this. God, we look like a serial killer. Yep, that's death. That's a serial killer right there. You just created. <laughs> Dead by Daylight's new sci-fi killer. His perks are sneak. <laughs> <laughs> and die. And yeah, and get die. self killed. Oh, and head chop. That's your mori. Hey, I'm healing. Two more. Yeah, I can count. Don't Please don't. Count. Thank you for not killing me. I really, ow. I really appreciate that one specifically not killing me. I'll just let her do it. Yeah, that's one way to do it. Okay, I think she got him. Did you get him? Thanks. No? Okay. Oh, damn. Mind the steam. You're liable to get scalded. To get oh. scalded? Not a polite thing. Uh, you good there? Are you okay? Something else is shooting you somewhere. Uh oh. I got it. <laughs> I'm still picturing your masked character jumping down and hacking things with axes. That's Wait. not scary. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> Sharply dressed, though, I must say. It'd just be cool if you could cover it in blood. Keep in mind. That's only, it only does that when we do a lot of damage to it. That's a lot of damage. Hi, uh, can, hey, uh, Parvati, can you deal with them? Uh, I don't ah! Know. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> the noise we make when we die is just. Oh, just remembered, Parvati, that's like a Hindu goddess name. I'm quiet. The wife of the Hindu god Shiva. I knew it was right. Oh, okay. I thought you were <laughs> yeah, she was shooting us. <laughs> hey, that's our job. We shoot people that are on our side. <laughs> Serial killer Joe. Joe. Oh, of course we're we're Joe Geekinson. Doctor Joe Geekinson. Because when you eat things, it keeps them as their thing when it moves on. See, bunching in. Oh God, I'm drunk. <laughs> Now we're feeling just fine. Drunk guy with an axe. Oh, that's almost death. You better heal. You probably ate all your healy stuff, didn't you? They can't open doors. I wish we could just see our character like squatting in the corner. <laughs> like like this. You could only put the third person on. Ah! Oh, you're dead. <laughs> oh crap, it does open doors. It's faster doors! <laughs> the robot uprising has happened, they can open doors! Oh, that works. If we put all the energy cells together, can we just not deprive somebody of their power? <laughs> Maybe. But we aren't like that. We aren't smart enough. I guess. We don't have the tech savviness. Hi. That's a lot of bullets. I just sawed this robot in half. And repaired it. With nothing. Yeah. What were we turning those on for again? You'll see. That's not... That's healthy. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of dripping magma. Mm, just taking a shower. That's, That's how I like the showers. Nice and magma-y. Mm, warm. I'm not even surprised. You probably <laughs> do. Like, you like your... As you like your cold. Yep. Like, you friggin... Okay, listen. Seriously, though. <laughs> you burn everything you eat, though. You can't. You cannot deny that. Like those pizzas you ate were just flat. We no, they no weren't. They were. Hey, Mister. Look, I know you want your power regulator and all, but do you understand what you're about to do? I know exactly what I'm doing. Part of body leave covers it. Yep. Power. I think it would be cool. I'm sorry. That just sort of came out all at once. 
Edwater's hurting. We've been losing yeah. workers year after year. Well, you know how you fix that? You just turn off their power and they go to the other anymore. place. But the town's got some good people in it. Decent, hard work. Yeah, so does the other place. Living their lives. They the should just go to the, the other place. They don't. So, what? So, literally, both decisions are bad. Yeah, but one of them is better than the other because they can just like. Re tells me it's going to die without workers in power. Well, that sure sounds like Mr. Thompson. In Mr. Thompson's eyes, though, I hate to say it, but. I th Wait, what now? I hate to say it, but. Miss McDevitt's just, built something beautiful. You know, he's right. Somehow she's talked the ground into giving life again. It's plain to see she's made the Vale a better place. Fed the hungry, tended the sick. Yeah. Gave a home to those that had none. But. Miss McDevitt delights in Edgewater. No, she so. doesn't. She just she wants the people her, from the there to go to her side. Do you really want to be party to that kind of hatred? Do you? Well, what about his hatred for them, really? Like, she's just, she's just gonna, like, I don't, I, I see Sorry, your point, I but I'm ready to make a decision. What What are we choosing? Just, like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna divert power from Edgewater. I don't care. <sighs> That's what I do in my game, and it doesn't matter. So, like, in... Do we just leave this town and I mean, le I mean this this planet when we do that and we could, but I mean we could also go to the other place. Does that I mean? Oh, does... yeah, also, I accidentally uh, in in my first game, I accidentally I didn't go to the botanical lab. I just went to the place that diverts power and was like, "What's the botanical lab diverts power to botanical lab?" <laughs> Hang on, before we choose, we could choose neither of these two things, right? No, one or the other. We got. Otherwise, the game can't progress. Are you about to choose? Don't worry about it. I was barely listening to you. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Here's the. Here's what I would choose. I would choose to divert power away from Emerald Vale. You mean divert it away from Edgewater? Because Edgewater is the place. Edgewater's the company. Yeah. Well, then what's her? What's the grandma's town called? Botanical Lab. Oh. Yeah, I like I, I I like them better, I think. Yeah. But she's right. It is it would be like hatred and and vengeance really that she would want you to destroy Edgewater, but Edgewater is also just Amazon. So Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's kind of Jeff like Amazon. Bezos who but it's baby face with uh it's baby yeah. with old uh What happens when filter. you do that in your version of the game? Um, nobody in Edgewater knew what happened and then Reed was like, "I'm going to kill you now." Okay. And wait. then I proceeded to chop his head off. Which was Wait, who's Reed weird. again? Reed is the guy who's telling us to divert it from them. I thought his name was Mr. Oh, his name is Reed. Reed Thompson. Reed Thompson. Thompson. Thompson, yeah. Oh, he, he literally wants to kill you when you do that. Yeah, he, he's hiding at the bottom of the uh, cannery, and he's like, I hate you so much. Yeah, I don't like him, really. Because really? he was I mean, he was nasty to her for no reason. Thanks, it shows I, uh, I enjoy no hearing from you. Oh, I get it. We're Shiva. <laughs> We're the destroyer. And that's Parvati. Sorry. <sighs> It just, it seems fitting. <laughs> Parvati is Shiva's wife in actual mythology. The Maybe. Destroyer. Carry on. Because I diverted it to Edgewater one time, and the grandma literally says, you're a snake, I hate you. you. But doesn't try to kill you. She doesn't try to kill you. She just says, I don't know. You you gave me hope, and then you crushed it. You're a, You're a snake. You are a reptile. I hate you. And it, I don't know, it makes me sad, I don't like it, but yeah. but Reed is just like, I'm going to kill you now. Yeah, I think I like that idea. That's what I would have picked. That's what I picked, so let's do that. Yep, that's the good guy way to do it, I think. Yeah, and the only reason that Parvati doesn't want us to do that is because her friends are there. Yeah, no, I hear you. she also... Which can go now into... Bloody Ed, or whatever the other place, Latino Cool Laboratory. Yeah. We'll we'll see them later. Yeah. Because like the companies are kind of like factions here. Yeah. Anti Cleo are better than Spacer's Choice. <laughs> What's that grandma's name? Who's like the robot maker in Futurama? <laughs> I don't know, but it looks vaguely like that though. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Here they come, and here the rest of them come because we're using gamma. 
Oh, dead. That's the last of them. <laughs> uh, yep. Sure is. That's not scary at all. That's just pleasant. It's <laughs> it's pops. <laughs> it is. We've already diverted the power, right? Have we? Hold on, let me check. Surely. Yeah. It would have saved. We have. The, the uh, evil of this is a version of the of Phineas. Kind of looks like Johnny Depp. That? Yeah, a little bit. The, yeah, that, that that that's meant to be a version of the uh, of the scientist. Oh, shenanigans! Oh, I'm not very good. Or you could just leave, run. Yep, I like that. Uh, there's no way out. <laughs> there is, but not this way. Yep, not the way I'm running. Yep, I did, and I'm about to die again. Good job. That's the geothermal power plant. There's more things in there for your dad. Died. That's the last of them. Dark <laughs> Again. I just imagine the Dark Souls, you died. You died. Thanks, appreciate it. This game's old school. It says game over. Alright, so we're where where are we heading now? Back to the Edgewater. Edgewater to tame. Hey, by the way, we chose the opposite of what you wanted. We decided that you're the horrible person. Bezos, baby face Bezos. Baby face Bezos. <laughs> Actually, I think we should probably call it here because I'm getting a little bit on the sick side. So, and we've completed the mission. You so. are on the sick side. Yeah, but well, I am. And so, uh, we've completed the mission. We have uh, screwed over the uh, the guy who sent us here in the first place. Because he's a. Because he's horrible. Yeah, he's he's uh, Jeff Bezos. In because the brain. he's. He's Todd Howard. Yeah. He's, he's, he's Todd Jeff Howard. Bezos we screwed Todd, Todd Howard over. Voice. I wonder if that's what that is. You think there's a little bit of Wait, a, is that is it obsidian? I just realized having you trick having you screw Todd Howard over? Wait, hold on, let me think about this here for a second. They were terrible to their employees. And yeah. the employees then eventually either were fired or left. Yeah. And then and those are the deserters. created their own company, I mean town. <laughs> <laughs> Which did we just solve the subtext of this game here? <laughs> <laughs> this this specific part of the game? Wait, the board as well. The entire thing is a company. Is yeah. this just an like a? Uh, it is. It's like a yeah. Is this a bad corporate? Hold on, but then that, that can be the subtext because they were making the outer worlds like just before Fallout seventy six and that whole debacle. Yeah. Hmm. And I think on that note, we're gonna leave it here. Thanks for watching Geek and Sun playthroughs. Please like us, love us, share us, and hopefully we won't die on our way back if we try this again. We're going. Uh, yeah, we're totally gonna do this again. Uh, oh, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> so we just screwed over Todd Howard. We did. <laughs> Good night, everybody. <laughs> <laughs>